and then after 20 seconds and a 5 million combo dribble, they do a spin move, they break the spin move halfway, they step back about 10 feet, shoot a three, green it, and then they get all excited. Yeah, look, it looked like y'all ran out of loyalty a long time ago. It's been fleeting. Look, Swan take the great. He didn't came across, and I don't know why he would jump bad like this. I guess it's for the views, 460,000 views on it. I don't know. I mean, we we tweeting for shock value these days, and I can't make it right, but I sure know that I didn't make it wrong. Look, this boy Swante said, laughing my effing AO. That boy Chris Smooth, a real NPC. He play like that and really think he right. Real sad times we in coming NBA 2K24. They got to stop crying and adapt. Now, I'm not sure what this stemmed from. All right, so let's run through what was said. And let's let's chop it up for ourselves. We're going to have to figure this out. Come on. The majority of people that are really complaining about the dribbling are the guys that dribble for the whole shot clock. And then after 20 seconds and a 5 million combo dribble, they do a spin move. They break the spin move halfway. They step back about 10 feet, shoot a three, green it, and then they get all excited. True. For the commentary, true. Those are usually the people that's complaining about the adrenaline and and all that right there. But why is why is he dribbling like he me? That is me for sure. He think he me. Let's keep going. Those are the people that seem to be complaining the most about the dribbling. And it's funny because even these dribblers, they know they're not playing basketball. If they ever make a video with a tutorial, they'll name the tutorial something like how to spam the curry slide how to how to cheese the entire game and not do anything worthwhile you got to go find some lackeys to sit in the corner for you and then you got to find some other lackeys to let's well not necessarily but maybe go find some other lackeys to let you win the game but yeah uh, to spam momentum how to spam the spin how to spam this even they know they're spamming all these years they know that they're spamming they're not actually playing basketball but here they are complaining about the dribbling and that it's not good the one thing that i want to i must take my time to say the points he is making are pointing they're pointing and i see why sensei swan swan is i see why he's upset because he's a cheeser. I mean, cheesers will be cheesers. You, you a hit dog gonna holler. You throw a rock in a pack of dogs, the only dog gonna yelp is the one that got hit. And it's funny because if you go back to the and one street days with hot sauce, you remember that? You remember those dribblers? Even they didn't dribble the way that people are dribbling in NBA 2K. Even they didn't do a spin move. I'm not gonna lie, they dribbled with purpose. Even, I mean, Hot Sauce, even Hot Sauce dribbled with purpose and, and got to the rim and made a beautiful move afterward, you know? So, I mean, he's right. He's kind of right, but and one players did spam it up. I'm just like, he's dribbling like he me. Remember those dribblers? Even they didn't dribble the way that people are dribbling in NBA 2K. Even they didn't do a spin move. They dribble with purpose, I'm not gonna lie. We are in the park slash city, not the NBA playoffs. You want realistic basketball? Go do your my career or go play now or go outside. This is pick up basketball, stop crying. Okay, I mean, I guess that is what it is. You can you can argue that, but um, at the end of the day, sir, I'm, I'm not buying it. You guys, you guys be cheesing sometimes. It's like, it gets repetitive all video game related side characters it's not that deep but put your panties back oh my god and then Swante said he had a whole two minute spiel and i kind of want to listen to it but i kind of don't hey hey listen this chris move is hilarious bro look at the end of the day i'm going to still beat the out of every single one of you none of uh respectfully Swante. I'm guarding this. You're gonna have to be really, really good. I wanna, I'm gonna go on a limb. I'm not even going that far on a limb right with this one. 
I'll break the whole bow. I'll go stand out there on the limb with this one. I'll stand with this one. This is the take I will stand on. If you're not doing it like and respectfully, because somebody might be out there doing it like if you're not out there dribbling like statistics, I don't really think you're doing it right. I don't think you're being effective. I think you may just be cheesing. I, I got to see somebody do it like that. He does it effectively. He makes sure you can't touch him. He makes sure he gets to his open spots and he, he fades on you or he goes to the rim. He dribbles with purpose. And it's not just a bunch of spam just to spam and just to, you know, do twisty twist and curly cues and look good. You know what I mean? He makes it look good. He spams it up. But at the same time, he dribbles with the purpose. And that's all I'm looking for out of it. Like, who's dribbling with purpose? Of you will put up any bread to face me. All right. I mean, we coming up on crossplay. And I am on the Xbox side of things. So, you know, we're going to have to see if crossplay is holding up. If crossplay holds up and Xbox is able to sync up and, ta and not be taken advantage of, then, hey, we might see some good wagers. We may see some good wagers as a community. But you're talking a lot of you talking a lot right now, Swante. In which you're entitled to talk your sh you talk your sh but I'm guarding that. I'm guarding that. Respectfully, I am guarding all of that. Right? I could not play the game for five months, get on the game and beat the sh out of a hundred percent of you. We'll okay, that's where I stopped listening. Y'all wanna keep listening to this? Y'all can go check it out if y'all want to. I'm not you you in words hating on Chris Smooth now? Like be real, the game is dying for a reason and most of next generation players prefer Rec Pro Am. He's just stating facts and at least he's not one of you anime profile picture weirdos who might be B words in RL. Dante came back with no, he's hating on us. The game is dying because of negative win percentage NPCs crying and ruining the game. I mean it Points are made. Points are being made on both sides. I mean, I'm not going to knock anyone's view of, of, of anything. So you got no females IRL. What does that have to do with? And you got your BF gun on your face. I'm talking like that. I'm, oh my gosh. It's a lot going on here, guys. There's a lot going on in today. Chris Move came across and he shot his, uh, he shot his gun off. You know, he had to respond in his way. And it made a lot of sense to me. A commentary from two years ago shouldn't be getting this much attention. That's the opposite of adapting. Um, he may have a point there. Uh, Mooksy, Mooksy came back and said, I posted the original video, did not anticipate it be retweeted and reposted by bigger accounts. I've been supporting you since I was six years old just thought the video was relevant conversations going around recently my apology so a true fan posted this he has the shirt right here he has the splash shirt we all know that's that's definitely chris smooth shirt and that's tough that's tough that this got this much attention from swante because swante is a dribble head and it's dribble heads versus old heads these days sim nation versus dribble nation and that's just what it is. Me personally, I picked a side a long time ago. I am definitely on I don't give a, I don't care side. I don't care about that. I don't care. I don't care. Dribble, dribble, dribble if you want to. You can dribble all day. If that's what you want to do, go have fun doing that. If you come up across me, I'm strapping that. If I really want to. I mean, if I'm actually, you know what? I've even adapted to, I will sit there and watch you dribble. I don't care. That's how much I don't care. I will de defend you and watch you dribble and, and critique as you dribble. You make a good move. I'm, hey, what I'm going to do? There's guys in the NBA that don't defend that shit because they don't care to. James Harden stepped back on me 14 feet. I'm not about to chase that. I mean, at the most, I mean, at the most, I'm, I'll stay in front of you, make it look good. They don't even play. They don't even play defense in the NBA. What I look like playing my heart out in 2k in the park because you want to dribble 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 go ahead dribble bro have fun make it look good but at the end of the day i do not want you looking at me like i'm an npc 
you're more npc get out doing all that extra dribbling that nobody wants to see and nobody cares to watch that much i mean if you think you're cold-blooded because you can do all that anybody can do all that i got clips doing most of that stuff a lot of it is just janky controller manipulation and i mean yeah it's fun to do if that's what you like to do that's my point I mean, I'm more or less, I'm an old head. So I like to go in the 5v5 rec or go into the comp program and really get busy as a team and break it down that way. I don't really, I mean, I do like getting open, getting to my spots, but I want to see y'all do that with a purpose, not just to dribble it out for 40 seconds and then throw up a dumb shot. I mean, it looks good when it looks good though. I can't lie to you. Uh, Chris Moves calls out the dribblers of 2K community and says they're not playing basketball. At a, at a certain point, you're not, you know? Um, That's a new move, laughing, bro. This is how dribbling's supposed to go according to Chris move. This is funny. This is a funny one. So your point still stands from two years ago. You were right though. It's the reason why they don't play park, why I don't play park or rec either. Pro-Am and rec is cool since it ain't that many cheesers. Park is where the dribbler gods be at talk that talk okay they they own it they mad because you right i mean it's so he has his guys are here his guys are here um i can't see where y'all okay my thing is i cannot i don't understand where you get off coming at at chris move like like how you gonna get at he's like the grandfather of of the elgato when it comes to 2k he was the first one to fire up the elgato and say let me capture some gameplay and put this out he kind of he kind of gave us all our first glimpse of of what content creation would become he was like ahead of his time and i think i think he should be celebrated i don't think anyone should fix their mouth to really to really voice an opinion against what he's talking about like that especially a gameplay from two years ago that's not that he's not wrong about he's not wrong if you want to do spin backs all day that's you you do spin backs but that's that's not it your booze mean nothing i've seen what makes you cheer